Welcome to this video against Topa. Scandinavian defense. All right, so let's see. Queen f5. Mm -hmm. Okay, I played the, the classic way, I guess. I like just developing the pieces. Bishop d2 maybe next. Hmm. Is that move that great? I'm not sure. Isn't it possible to play f3 even? And win some time? And then the knight to e2 later on. Oh, I just move it to e2 first. f3 doesn't run away, so... Um, maybe, yeah, now I play it. I can play knight g3 afterwards, just to attack the, the bishop again. And maybe bishop d2, eyeing the queen. Hmm. Just wonder if the d4 pawn isn't too weak, maybe. So knight d5 might be an option. Isn't knight d5 quite strong? Not anymore, I guess. But I mean, I can exchange that knight. Huh. Where does the queen want to go to? Let's do that. Queen a4, I play bishop b3. Isn't that good for me? And now c4. I'm just winning more time. Maybe knight c3 also. But how can I attack the queen on a6? Not that easy. I think I leave it like it is. So. Um, hmm, although, let's take here, produce a double pawn, and I want to keep the d4 pawn for sure, and now the castle short, I guess. Well, I'm not that happy about my position, I have to, uh, have to admit. Um, maybe again some space here. No, I can't. I need to... Well, I just blundered, I guess. You can take on e2 and then take on b2. Okay, and can play rook c1 and he open up the b-file, so it's not that bad for me. Hmm. I have an even better move, maybe. Bishop f5. And then I castle long. Uh, castle. Let's do that. And then rook b1. I will replay rook b1 next. Where does the queen want to go to? Let's attack the queen. So now we have an attack on b7. Wow, that's uh, nice to see because this diagonal is weak. Can I do something with the queen here, I wonder? So, 
Well, I'm not sure. Maybe I need to play f4 and then bishop f3 just to secure the bishop here on this di diagonal. I think I do this. Well, let's do this. I tried c4 and d5 next, maybe also. I mean, needs to go to c4, I guess, with the knight. Mm. I can play bishop e1 and bishop f2. I think that's what I want to do. So at the moment, there are not that many weaknesses in my camp. But I'm a pawn down. But the, the king's side position of black is rather weak. So maybe I have time to play something like f4, bishop f3, and queen e4. That would be deadly. I don't get that one. But what did I overlook? I just take it. Oh, I don't understand it at all. All right, let's play c5. That is strange. Why did he do that? Couldn't he just retreat the knight somewhere? Ah, I didn't even see that. I had uh, rook b6 and the queen was hanging. All right. Um, let's do this. And now c5 maybe. This should be like a like strong rook b6 is coming or ab and then rook b6 something like this do i have g3 maybe okay i take that one this looks deadly Yeah, there was not much to do, I guess. I mean, if he takes, my, my rooks come to play, and if he plays a6 or a5, I play the rook to the a-file and also will win on the a-file. And he's much too slow here. I can just retreat bishop to f2, and those two bishops are really, really strong, whereas, um, well, he's just a piece down and doesn't have any attacking chances. So thanks for watching.